now that we got the car running right, I'm going to have to fix the suspension. I don't know how much of this y'all can hear, but the smallest little bumps make for the roughest ride. And I'm not sure if it's the front splitter decoration or if it's the exhaust or what. But the smallest little indentions in the road bottom this thing out. So I ordered a new stock style SVT full suspension and we're going to replace it all. I don't know if the previous owner had lowered this thing before or this and this. Oh, I don't know if you can hear that, but something's scraping hard. Anyway. I'm gonna get that new suspension on and hopefully fix all this. All right. Ooh, ooh. So we got our new spring shock assembly in. I'm gonna have to put it up in here. Get the tire off. Three bolts here. One, two, three. And some more stuff up under there. I'm gonna get the tire off and I'll show you better. All right, so like I said, we have these three bolts here come down here I'm gonna have to pop off this dealy it's just a brake line unbolt this which holds on your anti sway bar here and then this little thing it's for the ABS I don't know anyway if you look right here there's this single bolt that pinches the actual sh uh, strut assembly and then lines up with this so this will get pinched it with that single bolt. So we undo this one bolt, the three up top, and this will all fall out. Ooh, spiders. So let's get that done. Yes, baby, yes, baby. So we pulled this off with a little 15 millimeter wrench. I'm gonna use a hex key in the end of this so it stays put, and then undo it. Pops out of there. Pops this dilly bopper off. Now, with the 15, we're going to undo the one pinch bolt right here. There shouldn't be enough weight for this to hurt me or go anywhere, really. So, let's just get her done. Herd! All right, there he is. Dora, 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 the Explorer. Still stuck in there pretty good. Uh, let's get a hammer and hit it. Now, if you're going to use a hammer on this thing, make sure you only hit this big cast part. Well, I guess you can hit this too since you're replacing it, but you want to hit things that aren't going to jack up too bad. Thing. Oh my gosh. Okay, don't hit that with a clawed hammer. That's dumb of me. Alright. Um, let's undo these top bolts and then we can force it down. So these are 13 millimeters. Whip them off, whip them off. Whip them off, whip them off. Oh, oh is it going to come down? Maybe, no, maybe, a little bit. Off. One, and two. And three. All right, now 
push down on this. Well, I guess we can yank here. And then, this is hard to do with one hand. Grab the spring, or this, whatever. Somewhere. Shake, rattle, and rubber when we'll wiggle it off. I'm gonna go to wiggling. Y'all hang on. After much wiggling and grunting, we got this dude out. So now, pull, take the new one. You can see the slot here. And then this piece here. It's going to need to slot right up in there. So we're going to take and put the top in first. Look down my hole. Oh man, doing things with one hand is difficult. Make sure it's pointing in the right direction. Oh, oh, cone holes. Uh, uh, there's one. Uh, uh, line up. Line up with them little holes. Oh my dear. Wham! Okay. We got some things up. Let me throw a little screw on one. Maybe on to you, just to make sure that stays. All right, I'm gonna go down here. We got all this nonsense. What's kitchen? Oh no! Oh Lord, I'm bursting out. drama get that in there get you a jack start jacking it up after you have the top end then you got this slit in here and then just keep jacking it until it fits and this little bolt will go in after it catches on the little hook it goes in the little hook and then we'll tighten this down then we'll reattach everything we can do that now a little bit reattaching and then of course we'll put this back don't forget this piece tighten everything up we're gonna put it on the ground go for a test drive and see if it fixed our bottom and out and awful riding characteristics this thing is so much better I realize how I think the suspension was just so worn out I don't think the previous owner lowered it Correctly, but we're about to hit the bumps we hit in the beginning before we changed it. Let's listen. <laughs> yeah, another bottom down. And this is just the front, the back you can still feel is loose and bouncy. All right, here's some more bumps. Nothing, <laughs> I love it. All right, let's get the back done. <laughs> 